Hello Pelican Sound members and golf professional Tim Harris and I'm here to talk to you about some of the new rules of golf that are going to be taking place starting January 1st 2019. At Pelican Sound uh, we're going to implement these rules starting November 1st so we have a little bit of a transition period we'll call them local rules to kind of get everybody up to speed and used to what these new rules are going to be all about so when January 1st does roll around it'll be a pretty smooth transition into these new rules of golf. Uh, the rule I'm going to talk about today has to do with hitting a ball out of bounds or having a ball that is lost and doing away with the stroke and distance. Under the old rules of golf, if you did hit a ball out of bounds, you would have to go back to the original spot that you last hit and replay that shot under stroke and distance penalty. But starting in 2019, as a new local rule for clubs, you can do away with the stroke and distance. So as you can see, we're here on river hole number nine up the right side, as all of you know. Out of bounds goes up the entire right side of the hole, as you can see by the white stake here. So I hit a tee shot and I hit the ball to the right. Didn't quite see if it went out of bounds or not. So I don't have to hit a provisional now. Under the new stroke and distance rule, if, even if I don't find the golf ball, I can determine where that last crossed the margin. And under penalty of two strokes, I can go over to the fairway here so what i'm going to do is i'm going to make my determination that the ball came in here into these palmetto bushes never found the ball so under penalty of two strokes i'm going to walk over here to the closest edge of the fairway okay so now i'm on the closest edge of the fairway as close to the out of bounds marker that i was at so what I can do is I can measure two club links from this edge of the fairway that's directly opposite where the ball last went out of bounds and is not closer to the hole. So I can measure two club links and I can drop my ball anywhere within these two club links from the edge of the fairway or all the way out over towards the out of bounds marker. So actually I'm going to show you another new rule here is how to drop the ball. Under the new rules of golf, you can also drop a ball by standing knee high. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the drop. And that ball is now in play. So I hit my tee shot. That was one. Couldn't find the ball. Assumed that it went out of bounds. So under penalty of two strokes, two and three, I dropped. Now I'll be hitting four for my next shot. So what this does in the interest of speed of play, it prevents you from having to go all the way back to the tee if you didn't find your original ball. So you can take a drop all the way out of here to the edge of the fairway, two club links from the edge, and you can go ahead and hit your next shot. If you have any confusion of how I just described that, you can also look at the USGA rules video that we are going to attach to this as well. And if you have any questions, you can always give me a call at the golf shop. Thank you, folks.